We're getting a better look at the damage caused by a small tornado that hit Mesquite this weekend. Texas weather expert Jeff Jamison is here to talk about that first tornado of the season here in North Texas. Yeah, Matt, the tornado hit about 7.30 yesterday morning as a line of storms moved through. And it was on the ground for about an hour, crossed over 6.35. Uh, in over into South Belt lane, uh, lane before lifting. We launched Drone Force 11 and about the location the tornado came down. The National Weather Service estimates the maximum wind was 85 miles per hour, powerful enough to significantly damage one home. We talked to the homeowner, Tiffany Thomas, yesterday, hours after the storm. We heard the wind, but it wasn't nothing different as a Texas storm, and next thing I know, my house is gone. Surrounding homes will need roofs repaired or fences replaced. Everything in my house is shaking, shaking down my clock, all my medicine, all the dresses and stuff like that. Billy Lane has lived in this Mesquite neighborhood since 1989. On the day after the tornado hit, we found him outside picking up debris after his fence was knocked down. I thank God that nobody get hurt, really, you know. So that's all we can pray for. You know, hope it don't happen again, but you know, it can happen to you at any time. Before the tornado crossed 635, it damaged the roof and knocked bricks off the side of the activity center and Emmanuel Pentecostal Church. The church canceling services at the sanctuary. You can see all the glass here. It busted out the top of the window here. And it looks like, like again, like the neighbor's fence might have come through. Homeowners getting taste of how violent the winds of even a small tornado can get. A stop sign still on the ground, but bent over from the wind. And a two by four lodged into the bumper of an SUV. Just a reminder that we are in the spring storm season here in North Texas.